Hey everyone, welcome to another installment of Harry Potter Theory. In today's video, I'm going to be discussing the events that transpired post Deathly Hallows. That is, events that occurred after the fall of Lord Voldemort. More specifically, I'm going to be discussing whether or not the trio, Hermione Granger, Ron Weasley and Harry Potter, ever ended up finishing their education at Hogwarts. The 1997-1998 year was an interesting one. It would have been Harry, Ron and Hermione's seventh year at the famed magical school, Hogwarts. And I say would have been because the trio ended up spending their time elsewhere. 97-98 was the height of Voldemort and the Death Eater's power after his second resurgence. Voldemort had amassed legions of followers, taken control of the ministry and even ended up taking Hogwarts. Things were not looking good. In an effort to end Voldemort's oppressive regime, Harry, who had recently become aware of Horcruxes, knew that it was up to him to track them down and stop Voldemort, hoping to eventually bring back prosperity to the wizarding world. This meant ditching school entirely for the year, and instead using that time to track down Horcruxes. Naturally, Ron and Hermione weren't going to allow Harry to pursue his mission alone, which meant that they joined him in his search. However, what this also meant was that all three of the trio missed out on their seventh year of education. This poses the question, did they graduate? Did they finish their magical education? There is evidence to support that Hermione actually ended up graduating in 1999, which suggests that she ended up going back to finish. But what of Ron and Harry? Did they go back, or did they have bigger fish to fry? It turns out JK Rowling actually answered this question in an interview. Oh, speaking of Ron and Hermione, yeah, did they graduate from Hogwarts? Yes, did they? Harry and Ron didn't go back, Hermione did. Ooh, oh my. Did you bet right? I mean, come on, nobody's going to think Hermione wouldn't go back. I predicted, yeah. Of course she'd go back, she has to get her newts. Ron was really done with schooling. I think that it would be kind of tempting to go back just to mess around for a year and have a break, but he goes into the aura department. Kingsley would have wanted Ron, Neville, Harry, and they would have all gone, and they would have all done the job. So that would have been rounding up the corrupt people who were doing Lucius Malfoy, and trying to pretend that they really weren't involved. So there you have it, neither Ron nor Harry ended up returning to Hogwarts, but it certainly didn't stop them from being successful. Both boys ended up becoming impressive auras at one point or another, and it has been reported that Harry would even occasionally return to Hogwarts for a guest lecture. Sure, they didn't complete seventh year or write their newts, but they did defeat Lord Voldemort, so that has got to count for something. And that's it for this video. Did you know that these famous boys never graduated? Let me know in the comment section below. Until next time, let us step into the night and pursue that flighty temptress adventure.